breaking news alert. And I want to start with that breaking news alert. No investigative leads going into now day four of the search for missing 15 year old with autism. Thank you for joining me for News 2 at 3. I'm Mark Kelly. Sebastian Rogers was last seen February 26 at his home in Hendersonville. This search has been all hands on deck ever since. News 2 Story Gessner joins us live from the Shackle Island Volunteer Fire Department. And Tori, you just received some new information from law enforcement 30 minutes ago. Yeah, Mark, investigators are still treating this situation as if Sebastian Rogers just got up from his home and walked away. There have been no confirmed sightings of him on any surveillance video or doorbell cameras, and canines still have not picked up his scent. Investigators did find tracks leading away from his home, but they say that lead turned up short. Now, we were told that Sebastian is drawn to water, so that's where first responders have been focusing a lot of their efforts today. They went through maps showing just how much ground and air they've covered day to day. The first two days, searchers on foot walked more than 2,000 miles and still no sign of Sebastian. Now they're asking you, if you're in Sumner County or even counties like Davidson or Robertson, search your property every day and every night and look for any sign of disturbance. We're operating under the assumption that Sebastian walked off. Uh, we have no evidence to disprove that. Uh, the family has been nothing but cooperative with law enforcement and our investigation. Um, we are truly operating under the assumption that there's a child missing that needs our help. So if the public is out there and you have a house close by or not close by, right, check your property twice a day. If you find something, call us. If you have trail cams out on, uh, on properties that you hunt, check them. If there's an image that you think could be Sebastian, call us. Anything, any tip that you have, call us. We want to bring Sebastian home. You can hear them pleading with you there. They say it is key, though, that if you are going to search your property, do so in pairs because they say if they spot one single person alone, they have to draw resources and confirm that it is not Sebastian. It's unclear how long this search will go into tonight, but we'll keep you updated on air and online. Live in Hendersonville, Tori Gessner, News 2.